Hi everyone. This tutorial will show you how to integrate the dialog system for Unity with Opsiv's third-person controller. We'll set up the player and an NPC and write a conversation in which the player can buy a weapon from the NPC. We start with a new empty project in which we've imported the dialog system and third-person controller. I also used third-person controller's start window to set up the input and layer settings. The next step is to import the dialog system's third-party support. When that's compiled, we'll start by working off of third-person controller's clean scene. Let's turn off the description since that will just junk up the view for this example. To set up the player, the first thing we want to add is a dialog system third person controller bridge. Set the override actor name to player so it matches our dialog database. Assign the health UI element to additional objects to deactivate since we don't want that to appear during conversations. Select your unequipped item type, which in this case is the fist, and click the Find Item Types button to populate the item types list. That list is what allows the Lua functions to be able to add and remove items. Finally, add a Show Cursor on Conversation script. Now we'll add a Dialog Manager prefab to our scene. and then we'll create a dialog database. We'll want to define a variable to hold the player's amount of money. Let's call it dollars. and then we'll create a conversation that uses that and gives a pistol. We'll give the player two options to answer yes or no. And then if the player answers yes, we'll say here you go. And in the script field, we'll subtract 30 from the dollars variable. And then we'll use the TPC pickup item command or Lua function to give the player a pistol. Now that we have the conversation, we need to add an NPC to interact with to hold that conversation. I've prepared a prefab of the Doug model and set it up as a third person controller character. Now we'll want to create a child game object for the interaction. Set its layer to ignore Raycast, add some kind of a trigger collider, and then we'll add an interactable, oh, not an interact, but an interactable component, and a dialog system interactable. 
assign the dialog system interactable target to the interactable component, and we'll also make it a little easier to interact with this. Then add a conversation trigger. The interactable will inform the dialog system interactable target, which will then call the conversation trigger. And we can give it a shot. So we went through the conversation, and we can see now that we have a pistol. And that's it. Thanks for watching.